It's very easy to install software on Ubuntu, but it might be different from the way you're used to. So pay attention to this tutorial, it might be very helpful. On Ubuntu, you have something called a software center that is by default on the Unity launcher. The software center is the place where you can find thousands of applications that are ready to be installed on your system. They are often tested and maintained by Canonical or by the Ubuntu community. You can either browse through the categories or type what you're searching for. Once you've found something interesting, click on its line and then on Install. Type your password and wait for it to be installed. Now you can launch the software you just installed clicking on its icon on the launcher at the left of the screen. If you don't see the install button as described before, you can check the software sources that you are currently using. By default, Ubuntu will search a free and open source software repository, but you can also install proprietary software if you wish. If you're not familiar with the idea of software freedom, you can learn about it in our website, idyllix.net. It's worth taking a look at it. To install restricted or proprietary software and drivers, launch the Software Center and go to the menu Edit Software Sources and click the checkboxes Restricted and Multiverse. Now you can install these software using the Software Center. To play non-free media formats like Windows Media, QuickTime or Flash, search and install Ubuntu Restricted Extras. To play protected DVDs, press Ctrl-Alt-T and type the command that appears on the video. You only have to do this once to install the necessary software. Take a look at the page that appears on this video for more information about restricted formats and to understand why they are not included by default on Ubuntu. It is also possible to install software manually without using the Software Center, but we won't be talking about it yet. For now, the Software Center will do the job just fine. Next, you will learn how to find files, folders and applications in your computer.